It's off to the North Pole. Santa and his helper Toy Boy are busy getting ready for Christmas Eve. Let's go inside the toy shop and see what surprises they have in store for us today. Boys and girls, how are you all today? <laughs> Tell them hi, Toy Boy. Oh, my tempest is fugitive again today, isn't it? I have a poem I would like to read to the boys and girls today, Toy Boy. Okay. I was just thumbing through several books and I found this one. It says, Christmas is a lovely time for all folk to enjoy. It brings the sparkle to the eyes of every girl and boy. And I might add, the grown folks are filled with sweet content to see the happiness complete that Christmas joy has meant. The stockings hanging in a row, the lovely gifts piled high, the burning fire upon the hearth warns old Saint Nick is nigh. I don't know why they should be warned. A silent night is sweetly sung as we think of the eastern star of Bethlehem and three wise men who brought gifts from afar. So those who love their fellow men are glad it is December, for peace on earth and memories are precious to remember. Isn't that a nice poem? Ooh, it's a nice poem, Daddy. Which reminds me, Toy Boy, that one Ooh. of these days, very, very soon, uh, when is it going to be? Do you remember? Ooh. One of these very soon days, we're going to be reading to you the real true Christmas story from the Holy Bible, as we Ooh, always do. Yes One of these do. days, very, very soon. Very, very soon. Well, oh, they caught us over here in the toy shop, this part of it. Let's go back in there, toy boy. You have the helpers start to work again. Start to work again, everybody. Start to work. As soon as I get out, helpers, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> Going to have to get that saw blade sharpened, toy Ooh, boy. It sounds a little rough, doesn't it? <laughs> Let's see, where was I? Oh, <laughs> yes, oh, yes. I was going to read a couple of letters here. Is it time for, uh, for you know who? Time for you know who? The you know who, the little girl that tells the weather. Let's go over here and I'll sit down and maybe we can spend little time here thinking about that and finding out what she has to say for today. Uh, Montague was the last name, as you recall, Montague. that we talked about here on the list. Here is Todd and Danette and Whitney and Brian and Connie and Shauna and Teresa and Brad and Jason and Chester and Sharon. And I'm going to read a couple of letters, Toy Boy. Okay. All right. Sharon and Chester and Jason, Brad, Teresa, Shauna, Connie, Brian, Whitney, Danette, Todd, and Montague. <laughs> Dear Santa, my mommy is writing this for me because I cannot write yet. Say hello to Monty and Toy Boy. Here is my Christmas list. And then a nice list. Well, that's all I can think of to tell you, except that we will leave you and Toy Boy some milk and cookies. We will also, listen to this, tell Rudolph now, we will also leave Rudolph some carrots. <laughs> he dearly loves carrots. Uh, dear Santa Claus, I would like to have a... And my little sister would like to have a two. For my little brother, I'm five years old. Oh, that's a nice letter too, Toy Boy. Well, all right, boys and girls, keep those letters coming to Toy Boy and Santa. And it's time now for Cindy Snowflake, the weather girl. Three... Two, one. Well, we have good news today. The doctor examined Santa and Toy Boy yesterday and said they were in fine fettle. Of course, he Toy told Boy. Santa that he should lose a little bit of weight because he's a prime candidate for some kind of sickness. You know, boys and girls, being overweight is as bad as smoking or using drugs. All those things can make you sick. You might get high blood pressure or diabetes or have a heart attack or any number of things. Mrs. Santa has already lost 40 pounds, I heard, so probably Santa will be losing some too. Now the weather. Look for some more snow at the North Pole this weekend. We'll let you know how much we get Monday. Bye-bye. Boy. Boy, boy. Woo. I say uh, we're going to have to pay a visit down there to Miss uh, Snowflake. Yes, because I think she gets a little too personal about uh, how the doctors talk to us and uh, examine us and what they say about us. And, and uh, I think that maybe we need to pay her a visit. <laughs> and especially when she begins to talk about Mrs. Santa and her diet. <laughs> oh, bring me some mail, toy boy. Bring me some mail. And also bring your little slate while you're down there. We have a lot to do today. 
Now, not to do. There's the mail. I'll put it over here with this other sack. And now, uh, there's the slate. And, Toy Boy, how many days does that say? Oh, this says we get nine days left. Nine days? No, 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 no. It says six days. This is nine days. Oh, on your side. I, I That does it to me every time, doesn't it? All right. Six days until Christmas, Whee! boys and girls. Six more days, and that means only five more nights. Whee! Hold up five fingers, Toy Boy. Only five, four five more nights until Toy Boy and Santa and Rudolph and the eight tiny reindeer and all the toys for the girls and boys will get into the sleigh. And right now, we're going to take just a little break. So, boys and girls, come right back. We'll go zooming. <laughs> The moon on the breast of the new fallen <laughs> snow gave a luster of midday to objects below. <laughs> I was just getting warmed up and rehearsing, Toy Boy. Mm. Are you well rehearsed? Well, well rehearsed. Hearse and rehearsed. Hearse and rehearsed. You know, boys and girls, what we're talking about, don't you? In just a few days, in fact, on the night before Christmas, we'll do this, won't we? The night before Christmas, we'll do the night before Christmas. Yes, we'll do the night before Christmas, Toy Boys famous rendition of the night before Christmas will be on the night before Christmas. Not on the day after Christmas, but the night before Christmas. Uh, explain that again. Not on the day after, well, the night before, the night before, but the night before Christmas. Because we don't want to do that tomorrow or the next day, and we want to do that the night before, so we don't do it two days ahead of time. But what we want to do is come in and do it the night before Christmas, because you see, if we do it the next day, it'll be too late. And if we do it two days before, it'll be too soon, and we don't want to do it the we want to do it the night before. How much is three and three, Toy Boy? Is that on the night before the day? No, after? just how much is three and three? Three and three. That's six. Why is it that you know that so quickly, but it takes you so long to tell us when's the night before Christmas? Well, you see, the night before Christmas is the night before we usually go zooming around the big way around, you see. We don't want to do that the day after or the next day, because then it'll be too late, and everybody will already be gone, so we need to come back in here and do it the night before Christmas. All right. <clears throat> so only five more nights, boys and girls, until Toy Boy and Santa and Rudolph and the eight tiny reindeer and all the toys for the girls and boys. That will be on the night before Christmas. The night before Christmas. We don't want to do it the next day because then it'll all be over with. We don't want to do it two days before because it's too soon. So we want to come do it the day before Christmas. Now I've forgotten what we're supposed to do on the night before Christmas. Oh, we're going to read the night before Christmas. We'll read the night before Christmas. Oh, we're going to go zooming around the big wide world. Zooming and zooming and zooming and zooming. Around the big wide world. <laughs> well, Toy Boy, I have my second wind. We do. Yes. We didn't do the first one. Oh well, it just left. I ran out. You ran out. Yes, I well, just. Did you put your coat on? It's cold outside. Well, I know. I always do put a coat on when I go out, or a cape, or something. But uh, what I meant was, I am just getting my second wind. That's what they say about the great athletes of the world, the ones who have the endurance. You get real tired, but then suddenly it's like shifting gears. Shifting gears. Yes, it's like, like the reindeer jumping to the other side and, the and lifting a little bit and, and going, going that second fall. mile. Going you get that second fall. wind, going going and then you go zooming and zooming, 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 zooming and zooming, and it doesn't bother you at all. All of us folks who are in great shape. <clears throat> uh, we'll be back in just a moment, boys and girls. <clears throat> well... Figurative. Just trying to clear the air here a little clear bit, Toy Boy. Clear the air. Get everything out of the way. We got the wind 780,000 coming in for a landing. Are you quite through? Quite through. Quite through. Are you ready? Are you going to sing another song for us today? We'll sing another song. All right. Why don't you have Squeaky come up there and. Uh, no, not Squeaky today. Not, oh, is Squeaky still upset? Oh, it is. Scruffy, scruffy. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, hi there, Scruffy. How are you today? Oh, really? Oh, Squeaky, uh, talk to you about that, huh? Uh, well, <clears throat> all right, then. I'll just stay out of the way this time. I won't... I'll try not to get carried away. I won't promise. All right, I'll, I'll go over here out of the way, and you two... All right, little elves. 
Start the band. Well, it was not easy, but I stayed out of the way, didn't I? Who are you doing me this evening? Uh, most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> you what? Oh, <clears throat> you know now what squeaky meant, huh? Well, I'm, I'm sorry, Scruffy. I, I just, I caught myself. I almost got in there, and then I caught myself you once. You quit yourself, didn't you? What? You quit yourself. Yes, I caught myself. Hmm. Didn't you do this? How did I do that? <laughs> Well, no comments from you, toy boy. What I meant was I, I realized uh, in time to stop, and I just caught myself like that. Ooh, but that's a good thing, Sadie. Do you mean to go now? Okay, we'll see you later. Bye-bye, Scruffy. Thank you. Well, at least I didn't upset him too much. I think I'll go over and see what's behind the super-secret surprise <laughs> door. I wish, toy boy, that I didn't get so excited when the singing all started, because that always gets me excited, and I have to just about start singing with you, you know, or doing something anyhow. <laughs> well, we had to use a big truck to get this one in here, didn't we? My, look at this. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of my favorite songs. Jingle bells, jingle bells. Well, I guess the helpers took the day off today. And, oh, no! Oh, no! They did! They did build a toy! Let's make room for whatever's going to come down the chute. Let her roll! And we did the same thing it did yesterday. <laughs> I guess we're going to have to grease the skids coming down there, toy boy. Toy boy, are you there? Yes. Well, that's all right, because sometimes the toys come down so fast, the boys and girls do not have time to see what they are. And I want them to see they're there, and they're okay. They're inspected and ready to go. <laughs> I'm going to move everything out of the way in anticipation of a visit. We're going to have a visit, I hope, in just a little bit from old Montague the Moose. He hasn't been around several days, so I'd like to find out what's with him these days. All right? All right, stay right where you are, boys and girls. <laughs> Glad to see you, Montague. Oh, well, it's uh, nice to be here, Sandy. I've Always been... nice to come back in here and see you and the little feller back there. And uh, it's just uh, real nice, you know. Well, we like you. We like for you to come around once in a while. What have you been doing to keep so busy? You haven't been here uh, recently. No, no, I've been uh, watching all of them... Uh, 
college football games going on around the country there, oh, you know. yes. It's been pretty exciting, you know. Yes, I suppose it has been exciting. The boys and girls down there in the United States of America like to play football. Oh, yes. yes we get a lot of orders for footballs for them. Well, I used to like to play football, except I used to keep puncturing the ball with my antlers, you see. Oh, yes, that happened the other night over at the concert. No, at the volleyball game. The volleyball Where was game. it? Volleyball? Uh, yes, at the volleyball game. Oh, I think so. Yes, yeah. uh-huh. Well, that's one of the problems us mooses have, you know, but uh, I was down there a while back in the uh, United States of America. Oh, think. were you? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. I was watching some of them college football teams down there, like, uh, oh, they got one down there in uh, Kansas. It's uh, KU and Mooses too. I think their uh, fight song is uh, Rock Sock Moose Socks. Oh, no, 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 I don't... I think you misunderstood. Oh? No, I think that uh, that team, let's see, down there in, in what state did you say, Kansas? Oh, that was uh, Kansas, yeah. That's, um... Rock Sock Moose Socks. Rock Salt? Rock Sock Moose Rock Socks. Rock Salt, no. No? No. That uh, wasn't it, huh? Huh? That wasn't it, huh? No, uh... Has, has a letter in front of it. X... Oh, no. Why? J, 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 J Hawks. Oh, Jayhawks. Jayhawks. Rock. Oh, it uh, wasn't moose socks, huh? No, no, not moose socks, no. Oh, oh, well, maybe I had it mixed up with the other one there, that uh, K-State Wild Moose Cats. <laughs> that's, uh, what state is that in? That's uh, down there in Kansas, too. That's also in Kansas, too. Yeah, uh -huh. that's, uh, uh, no, let's see, what did you say you thought it was? That was the uh, Wild Moose Cats. No, I think it's the wild, just the wild cats, I oh, think. Oh, is that what it was? Yes, I don't think oh. there's any moose involved. Oh, well, maybe I got it confused with uh, WSU down there. WSU moose shuckers. WSU, that would be in West Virginia, no, W... That was down West there in Washington? Kansas, too. See, it was a WSU was the name of the school, and they called themselves the moose shuckers. Oh, no, 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 no. I think that is a, uh, that's another misnomer. A who? A misnomer. Oh, I thought it was WSU. Well, no, what I mean is you you misunderstood the name there, too. Oh. Um, let's see. In other words, it's a misnomenclature is what I, the word there. Let's see. Oh, I um, see. What would that one be? Sh what kind of moose shockers? Moose shockers, yeah. Let's see. That would be in down there where they grow all the wheat that makes the bread and all goes around the world. No, that would be wheat. That would be oh, wheat, wheat shockers. Moosers. Yes. Yes, not wheat mooser, no, oh. wheat shockers. Oh, I see. They shock the wheat. Well, uh, maybe uh, maybe I got it confused with that team down there in Oklahoma, you see. The uh, Oklahoma moosers? You know their fight song, Boomer Mooser? No, just just a moment. Uh, no, I believe that's Boomer Later. They're called the Laters. Oh, Boomer Later. No, 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 it isn't the Laters. It's the... Uh, Boomer Mooser. Sooner, Sooners, Sooners. Sooner, mooser. Sooner or later, uh, which is Sooner, Sooner. Oh, Mooser, Sooner. Yeah, well, what that is is a contraction for the Prairie Schooners. Oh, it is? Yes, the Prairie Schooners they used to have down there many, many years ago, which were big wagons, and they oh. had uh, canvas-like tops on them, and they called them Prairie Schooners because uh, just like a schooner on a ship that's on the water, uh, they didn't have the water. They just had the prairie. Oh, they didn't call them moose wagons, huh? No. Well, they may have had, no, probably buffalo wagons. Oh, buffalo wagons? Oh, yes. Wagons. I remember oh. when they used to have a lot of buffalo down there when they did roam. Oh, I see. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, yes. well, they, they had a pretty big game down there a while back, you see, the uh, that Oklahoma team and the uh, Nebraska corn mooskers. <clears throat> um, I, I, think, um, I think here again, Montague, you have uh, misinterpreted. Oh, I did? Yes, I don't think it's... I don't think it's the, what did you call them? It wasn't the uh, corn mooskers? No, no, no. Then they run out in the field and say, go big red moose? No, it was the corn huskers. Oh. See, they husk the corn when they, well, they don't do that so much anymore, I suppose. Uh, but back in the old days, they used to go out and husk it by hand. They husk it by hand? Yes. That'd be a little hard for us moose, you see. Yes, it would. We have hoofies. You could husk it by hoof, I guess. Well, I guess we could. Uh-huh. You sure that wasn't the uh, Nebraska corn mooskers, huh? I'm sure. I'm sure. Hmm. Well, I must have got it turned around somewhere. Well, maybe I got it confused with that other state up there. You know, the Ohio State moose eyes? No, no, no. Um, there again, it isn't the moose eyes. Oh, it isn't? No, no. Moose ears? No, not the moose ears. Moose nose. No, not the moose nose. How about the moose antlers? 
No, no. I believe that would be the Buckeyes. Buckeyes? Uh, <clears throat> well, um, let's see. Uh, you are a... Uh, I'm a moose. You're a moose. I got moose eyes. You have moose eyes, but you're also... Well, a, a male deer is called a buck. Oh. Uh-huh. Um, and a male moose is... Well, uh, anyhow, it's the Ohio State Buckeyes. Oh, it uh, is. You. Yes, uh-huh. You mean them deer got a college down uh, there? I, I, well, I think we probably should drop that one right there, because mm. I don't think you would understand, after even after I explained it to you, what those were. Oh, I see. You might get a little, uh, a little fearful. Oh, well. And I would like to have you cheerful. <laughs> Maybe I ought to go back to Moose U again. You yes, think? I think you should go back to Moose U, yes. Uh, would you care to tell the boys and girls goodbye? Are they leaving? Uh, yes, they're going to leave for hmm. today. They going to Moose U, too? No, they're going, not going to Moose U. Well, I don't know what university they're going well, to. Well, if they're not going to Moose U, they're going to Moose me. Oh. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyhow, Good we'll evening. tell them goodbye, so wave oh, goodbye boy. to them. Good boy, boys and girls. Bye-bye, boys and girls. Bye-bye. I'm sure glad you came over, Marty.